Shalom, everyone. I hope that you are doing absolutely fantastic. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm jumping in on this video uh, after doing two other videos. The I had a rune that came out that stated that something hidden was going to come to the light about something, and my intuition began to go off, and uh, Yehovah began to speak to me. If you are new, welcome to my channel. My channel looks at a lot of criminal activity and stuff like that. It's not church or religious or anything. Could come across real heavy that way. I just love the truth. I seek my Abba, my Father in heaven. Um, in the truth okay and so um my channel is probably just different than what you uh have probably ever ran across and um, so anyway you'll just learn me as we go i feel energy and stuff like that and if you're spiritual then you'll understand that as well um but anyway welcome uh if you're returning welcome back happy birthday happy anniversary and all of that i'd just like to say that to you if it is a special day if nobody told you that then um let me say it um I took a rune, like I said, and something hidden was going to come to the light about some ordeal um, that was in that reading. And so my intuition began to go off in a very big way. And so I just want to do another reading in its place and see what Jehovah will bring out. So I don't like to waste the energy. So um, obviously I sit with the, the creator and, um, you know, alone and, and he speaks to me through his word and, and you know, and uh, on this table when I'm alone as well. Um, but uh, I just felt led to also do a collective reading. So if you had any specific questions about something just get real still if you need to pause this camera real quick then please do so and uh, i am a firm believer that if you are um you know very sincere with Jehovah, uh then he will meet you and he'll let you know what you need to know uh, obviously uh, you should say give give me an answer in what i'm allowed to know of the situation i my channel is not a channel that peers into things that i shouldn't uh, Jehovah reveals in his time and yet he does tell us uh, things that are going to take place before they do he might not give all the details to it but you will be able to go ah oh, you did tell me about this I didn't know all of it but you did tell me about the ordeal um, so anyway if you do have a specific question about anything then uh, please just get real still and uh, ask uh, Abba what uh, your question is and believe that you will receive what you need and he he will he will he will do that for you okay um thank you hold up for clear to find messages rebuke and bind and block every foul wicked dark nasty energy malice greed hateful murderous uh activity uh any magic uh black magic talking to the dead occultic nasty uh demonic entities Jehovah just uh kick you right in the head Jehovah rebuke you Jehovah I thank you for the uh, archangels I thank you for your angel that encamps around us that do um fear you what do you want to bring out here about what you were talking to me and any other person nothing's too difficult for you you can bring out many different scenarios to just a couple of cards and answer questions and give enough information to lead them in the right direction and myself as well so you'll hold Elohim maker of heaven and earth I inquire at your hand your hand alone you are the great Yeshua I thank you for your uh, son that walked among us in the uh, earth in the flesh we have a lot that's come out here you are great Yeshua. Okay, yeah. It is coming out here. <clears throat> Thank you, Yehovah. We have the night of... Uh, we have two nights out here. We have the slowest night of the deck and the fastest night of the deck coming out here. So this is the in and out, a departure type of card. I'm fast. I'm hasty. I'm a player. A lover could be here as well. Um, passionate stuff. And then we have slow. I'm checking details. I'm just going to look out in space sometimes. Let me look at the picture. If something was going down, we had something that came out, the boss knows something. Okay. Then uh, something 
you're dealing with somebody who's fast all the time and too fast and then somebody on the other extreme of that that's too slow and something went down within some ordeal then possibly something's here around something like that okay we had some kind of collaboration around some ordeal somebody's in their head looking in the mirror they're empty on the inside they might be pretty and show up or we did have the um the hottie card that came out in another little deck that I use in that reading uh, when my intuition began to go off about something and it has a meaning of uh, you know being pride and conceitful and hey look at me kind of energy and stuff like that so this kind of energy would be real passionate but somebody somebody might be real nice looking but on the inside somebody's somebody's wrapped up in tulip paper here somebody's empty because something that's taken place within some ordeal okay so somebody feels uh, insecure around some ordeal somebody did get thrown out or fired or something like that is here this is knowing uh with the full something was foolish okay so some some two people got in a fight around some ordeal because you're too slow or well, you're too fast and i couldn't find some you know happy medium to some type of ordeal then i could read this energy that way as well we do have two people though holding hands in this picture and somebody else possibly was just oblivious to something that was happening uh in some ordeal okay and something was foolish about it okay this is the letter top so the letter t is here specifically thus far in this reading uh capricorn taurus and virgo aries the sagittarius and uh, aquarius uh is here we do have air there as well and then all this is pentacles so uh what's at the bottom of the deck you hold up <clears throat> the letter noon is here tennessee is here in this reading the t and the n or the nt would be nate or nat or natalie or uh nathan or something like that um this is the sperm and somebody cheated i guess they did because i was coming out in that reading as well somebody's husband this is protection as well there's something about um look at the truth is here there is something about somebody's face that's very prevalent to something is what Jehovah said. This person's got their hand out. Somebody's trying to come with some information. Something's very much known. I know the truth. Okay, this also is the truth. Somebody got balancing issues within some matter because it's showing it real big here. Okay, but somebody's a show off at the same time. Okay, because that other card that was coming out, that hottie card, can it mean I'm a show off? Look at me. I'm genius. I just skip around because I know everything. Type of energy and something's happened here in a very big way and so somebody does know the truth of something okay it's because somebody did play within some ordeal but somebody's face is prevalent to some ordeal okay somebody obviously we got somebody who won't look in the mirror it's amazing a person's looking into the mirror but they're not they won't see their self because their eyes are covered they won't they just show up i'm cute but they they're because there's nothing on the inside of them they are not willing to look really at themselves i know what that feels like um just by experience when i was in my 30s and i'm 50 um i went through a really hard ordeal and uh, i got up every day and just functioned okay but i i came to a place in my spiritual walk that um you all had me look right into my own mirror literally and, and literally look down into myself and to forgive uh within the ordeal okay and some people got to forgive themselves some people got to forgive others it goes both ways okay As somebody here is empty and depleted and somebody also came out in wording today that somebody refuses to even take any steps they don't want to because something is so horrible something is so devastating here okay this is such a profound picture it is devastating because something about whatever took place for it to be known is devastating or what is already known and then but yet they still got some people on the outside uh, that need some type of communication about it is so devastating within an ordeal because some people are this is the incarceration card some people are you know not only just incarcerated in their mind they're jail worthy of something that's just so horrible it is it's horrible what's out here and somebody's face is prevalent to something okay it came out in the um it came out in in in, in wording in the phonics
What do you want to bring out here, Yola? I feel sick to my stomach. Um, this, the Psy card is here. This card can, uh, obviously, this is a widow card. If it's not a widow, it's some type of pain card. It can represent just grief, loneliness, isolation. Somebody just sighs all the time because something's so horrible out here, then that energy is here. Okay, the cat, somebody lied about something. That's falsity with the cat. That's defensiveness. Okay, somebody's defensive all the time. They're a manipulator. Then the cat card represents manipulation. And um, somebody is like that because we've seen the snake. There's a lot of money known about here. So the fortune, something's also fortunate as well. There is going to be a clean slate for somebody. There is. So they've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and don't lose heart for waiting. Show me more, you'll hold on what we need to know. Something does rightfully belong to somebody else. And that constellation card also showed itself today as well. Um, this is, you know, somebody looted on somebody for some people. Um, bonuses and purchases and small wins and some type of refund or you know um, a rebate of some type that's what that card represents we do see somebody praying though we're also seeing somebody praise some molded images as well okay because it, it's here um, again somebody's false somebody's a manipulator somewhere there's the lover card if there was a, you know, obviously there's a lover card right there. If this is also a potential love and somebody's won't look in the mirror at something uh, around some order to even fix something that should be fixed. Something like that's come through my spirit as well. We got music. We got something that was signed out here. So if we're talking about Tennessee, you're talking about country music or something like that or something that's connected to that kind of energy, that is here. Okay, whatever that is. There's a lot of fortune here around and somebody's face is known within that ordeal. Okay, this is a river, this is a prophet, this is being stretched out within something in the Hebrew. Okay, somebody trying to get their balance. This is a reconciliation. They, somebody knows the truth about something, trying to, to uh, reconcile. No, they need to reconcile, but yet somebody's looking in a mirror, but yet they're not. And somebody's a player around some ordeal. And they're a liar. And there's the priest card that's there. It also showed up in that reading. And then uh, somebody's face also got blown off is what Jehovah just said. Okay, somebody's face got blown off. And this is a haughty card. We had we had the haughty card. We had this card that goes back to anger. We had anger come out in wording somebody's hothead around some ordeal. They're false. Um, they don't have no patience. Let's go back to patience. And that was really coming out within some ordeal. This is somebody that's just tried their patience so long. And they just fly off the handle. Because they won't look in the mirror. They won't do it. Because they're guilty of something that's went down. Let's just pull some cards. Yeah, that depression card was also there. You hope that you just... You just tell it because you know everything that needs to be said. Glass or something sharp or some type of broken sharp glass was around some ordeal or you're done with glasses. So it's about perception. You hope it keeps bringing the eyes out. Somebody's eyes are are wrapped around. Somebody did lose their eyes. Um, in the morning time, something happened in the morning time or if, whatever that you can interpret it how you need. Jail, prison, and justice. And there's been somebody who has been back and forth in some type this back and forth energy within the matter, but there's no more. Something's happening here. There will be a jail, there will be jail and justice given to somebody. Thank you, Shotalama. Thank you, Yehovah. Yehovah stated today somebody was being watched. Um, the, there's a dad here. Uh, there's a specific father then involved in some ordeal. Okay, so if this is your children and you're an older person, because the devil showed himself today, that just goes back to real hardship and older people. Something real devilish has been around some situation. Somebody's dad is here. The, uh, the DA is also written here. We have jail, prison, and uh, justice will be had for some ordeal that went down within a matter. Okay, because somebody died. Okay, so the law is here. You're doing somebody who works in the law. 
and somebody knows the truth. It's as if somebody's trying to say something and somebody's like, uh-uh. That with clarity, I know the truth here. You know, it says that uh, somebody was paid off and there will be justice for whatever this was that went down within some matter. Uh, we keep getting like the gas station. We've had the BP come out and uh, we get the gas station come out again. So if you deal with somebody who worked for the gas station or something went down at a gas station and maybe somebody was robbed or something like that. Somebody's, head, somebody's got a gun to their head and so somebody was robbed and I guess they were for somebody's connection that's out here. Uh, kick. Somebody's, somebody, if you look, somebody's fixing to go to jail and be bent for something. There's stubbornness here around some ordeal or something got kicked. Okay, somebody's face got kicked. And again, I, I, I'm, I'm looking at a, a word that came out in the phonics. We have somebody's got the their head right here with this gun up to their face area. Okay, um, something is here around that energy. A movie star is here. Again, somebody's face is prevalent. Okay? There's a movie star involved in something. That's the same house right here, knowing something. Okay, we also have this house to take you back to the liver. There's a heavy drinker here. Okay? Or the word um, for the liver is written for high honor as well in the Hebrew. Um, there's a there's a there's heavy type of a weight energy and, and, and also heavy wealth is also, it, it is right here. It's right here. There will be justice for it, people. There will be a promise and a rainbow because there's gold at the end of the rainbow. And Jehovah's got a covenant with his people, okay? Uh, whoso loves instruction loves knowledge, but he that hates reproof is brutish. And Jehovah states that when the fools and the brutish people they just, um, they spring up together. They have no idea that Jehovah is having them all spring up together so he can, he can just take them on out. Somebody's family loves somebody for, uh, they just, they love somebody. We've had wording come out that my family understands now what happened. Okay, so my family loves you. Energy is here. And the boss, no, we do have a boss involved in some ordeal. It just keeps coming out. Something's very devilish around it. Very devilish because somebody won't return to make something right. They won't look in the mirror because some somebody's false because there's a bunch of money around something and somebody's uh, manipulated something real hard, real hard. There's going to be justice. What else do you hold up? Um, being at a crossroad, somebody trying to escape, we ain't going to be able to escape. Sorry. There's going to be jail and prison for you. Okay. For whatever this energy is for. And it's right here. The incarceration card is here. You will not, this, something was plotted as well. Again, there was falsity. There was manipulation around some ordeal. Uh, we got two people holding hands here. It's something rightfully belongs to somebody. Somebody went down the wrong path and, you know, wisdom stands here at the crossroad. Which way are you going to go? Because we actually had wordings that also came out, um, um, today that Yoga was saying, come and just plead with me. And, and so you can be justified within something. If somebody just knows information. You're just sitting there, but you know information because your kids are involved in something or your employees are involved in something or your family member, but you you won't look in the mirror because I love my kids, but it's going to, it's going to cost you worse. You are to love the great one more than anyone on this planet. Um, Somebody's at a crossroad or pl plotted or what are my alternatives or some, whatever that is. There, there's a contract around somebody as well. Somebody was paid off through some stupid because it was plotted out here. And that ain't all right. And the kingdom of darkness is going away. So because somebody don't like instruction. It just keeps coming out. Somebody had refused uh, to, to take any steps today in a reading. It comes out in a different way. You know, you're doing with somebody's brutish. They're just hostile all the freaking time. It ain't all right. You cause good people to get up and fight just as much, and they do it in the truth and roar right back in your face. The key, okay? A clue. Something behind closed doors is here today. This also came out in that reading. A solution and insight is here. Okay, well, somebody does know something. Somebody does know some information, okay? Even at a governmental level, the letter Q is here. That's the sun. 
uh, which in the Hebrew is government. And Jehovah's government is here. So we got somebody's house keys here, somebody's residence. We've got somebody's um, we've got somebody's uh, inheritance with this card. Stability is out here, but yet somebody else has been thrown out. And that ain't all right. Somebody knows the truth about the stupidness here. There's the lady right there. So we've had both lady cards come out here today. That's a significant person. It could be a child, it could be a younger child, or a mother and a child situation as well. Uh, somebody went to school with. That card also represents somebody stumbled up on something. So somebody knows something now. I guess they do. Um, that's also uh, somebody's got a childlike brain. Okay, something's happened. Somebody's mind. It was in some ordeal. Somebody was um, poisoned in one of my other readings. Okay. Somebody got kicked really hard with them some ordeal. So if you do with two X's, you are the gun is here. This is the GN in the runes, which make the phonics of a gun. We got the picture of the gun. Today I did a, a reading and the problem was somebody's rifle was also being portrayed in a um in in what the problem was within the ordeal so something about the, the the gun is here then this also goes back to um fertility somebody got pregnant somebody went off the handle something happened and i guess so somebody's shelter is here in this reading okay because uh, we got the house keys and everything else and somebody being thrown out here and somebody being played and uh so you're dealing with freak okay you really are because there's a lot of money around some situation um and some something's out here real big in this reading um this is a hidden relationship okay again also represents luxury we got a movie star out here pleasures things like this somebody else been living high off somebody else but they're a manipulator they ain't nothing they can't even look in the freaking mirror they're a freak and they're gonna go to jail and everybody's gonna know the true face of a thing they really are they really are somebody's that's a nag the other direction the ng and the gn some a nag is going to be gone it's cause of that bunch of people a, a, a big ordeal really is somebody's a devil within some matter um we've got the aleph head and somebody turning in fear um some or somebody was within the ordeal and they were just digging and digging and digging out uh in fear turning on the inside of them and since something's happened here with the gun okay something's here so the aleph head is actually the um the uh, magician card which we've seen it for the next couple of days real big this is about speaking this is a leader of a family or um to lay down new foundation but the magician in the reverse is a big time manipulator okay so what has happened is also a physician out here the garment of the high priest is here we got the priests here. You deal with spiritual matters, and there is a group involved because it really came out in my other readings, and it's amazing what Jehovah will bring out. Jehovah, give me a couple more words. A reservoir. Something was set back, and the storehouse energy is here. Okay, maybe you work for a place where um, something about a storehouse is here. Okay, um, some some type of a per, somebody who's been trying to preserve and protect something here some have been watching and seeing and they know and they understand again watching the eyes area seeing something some something about somebody's heart there somebody today in one of my readings they had some type of understanding in their heart as well somebody in the boss knows and there's knowing energy here as well wow. okay shonda la bahaya the heart to think um, the seed of passion, um, the heart, the organ itself really is, like I just said, it came out and uh, Jehovah is so magnificent. Jehovah, you get the praise, the glory, and the honor for always bringing everything to the light. And uh, if you go to when somebody has heart problems itself around some ordeal, then, then that's here. But that energy is all here. They will go to prison, yes, because it's here. So let every word be established in two or three witnesses for what they've done. They are caught. 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 Thank you, Yehovah, for justice.